I thought today we should talk a little bit about labia. Oh, labia, labia. The bane of my existence. Well, t today, teens are getting labiaplasty at like a record rate. It's amazing. And it's the number one plastic surgery. Carla, if this was available when I was young, you would have done the same thing. I probably would have done the same thing. So compassion, what we have to get over is a fixed idea of the female genitals. And also a lack of information on how to handle your labia. Like we all know men are always talking about balls and rearranging and Adjusting Jocks them. And, yeah. <laughs> and during sex, they're always talking about balls. you got to be careful about if you Very hit the balls. Very concerned about their testicles, my dear. <laughs> I mean, you could say they get in the way. Don't let your vibrator hit my balls. <laughs> like, or if you're doing certain types of positions and they squeeze the balls. I mean... Let's cut them off. So I got a... a thing popped up on Facebook, a little messenger, and it was a young woman asking about her labia and how during sex with her boyfriend that they, they're, it hurts because the labia is, they're long. And I just said, well, are you using lubricant? Chances are very good not. She said no. No. Now this is one thing that I want DNR to do. I want us to have our lubricant with our label. And we've got to push lubricant because no one's using it. It's so And then she said, aren't our juices enough? Uh-uh. No, no, no. No, never. No. We're, first of all, who's relaxed when you're having partner sex? And here's the thing. I, I, my vaginal juices are never going to be as good as oil. Uh -uh. Oil increases sensitivity. It increases sensitivity. You'll have a better fuck. The orgasm and it, it, will for be both partners, not just one. No. No. And the guys are doing a dry masturbation watching porn. Oh, getting all chafed and calloused. And no, we, we, it must, up. we must promote application of lubrication. It's the, it's the number one sex toy. The number one sex toy for your enhancement is additional lubrication. And you can get it at the health food store, at GNC, at Dwayne Reed. At, all you need is a clean oil. A nut oil. In in a pinch, you could use vegetable oil, olive oil. It smell like a salad, but it's better yeah, than... <laughs> our labia is a part of our sex organ. It it gets, when you're turned on, it gets, it plump, plumps up. No, it gets erect. It's erectile it's tissue. Filled, it. It's filled with all kinds of wonderful... Nerve endings. And blood... Vessels. Thank you. Blood, <laughs> blood vessels. A senior moment. It's It fills up with blood and it feels good. Truly, if you just touch them when you're turned on with oil. Let me tell you, I can't imagine. I have dangling in her lips. I can't imagine my sex life without my labia. If I have four or five clitoral orgasms with vaginal penetration, I always do the two. I can end it with the vibrator just on my labia or playing with my labia and I can have an orgasm and it's very intense. It's like that little inside of your vagina that's the most sensitive is attached to your labia. Yeah. That's the most yeah. sen yeah. sensitive part. Right at the opening. Yeah. Yeah. So there you have it. It's like, uh, do the guys say, my balls get in the way so I'm going to have them cut off? I've, oh, I had a, tons of balls slap you right in the asshole when you're happy. <laughs> when you're happy. I've done that. I've had that. Yeah. Bum, I thought you are going down bum. on them and it like slaps me. All those balls up, they're banging my butt. Can you imagine? <laughs> well, because they're sweaty. <laughs> it's like... Oh, really? Oh. If you'll just reach down before you have intercourse and put a little oil on it, on the exterior vulva, which would include your labia. Your labia. I always do clit labia. Yes, yes. Because the inside of your badge, even if and that's then moved, they, the rest is in. slide into place. And they feel they really good. They won't get caught. I mean, this is so ridiculous. It's because we don't understand our sex organ, and we're looking at porn, and the women in porn have their labias taken off. And they never use lubricant in porn. Or if they do, we don't see it. Yeah, they, they use a lube shooter and put it inside, but they don't have it on the outside because it's all shiny and it kind of ruins the because, shot. No, but no, but it's the myth is a man gets an erection and a woman gets wet. 
wrong. <laughs> yeah, you get wet. I get super wet. I still want lube. On well, the outside, I always do a couple of pumps and I go up and down. Always. And I have long labia and I've had sex with tons of people, tons of ways, big dicks, small dicks, but other vaginas, strap-ons. It's never gotten in the way. Have yours? Uh, one time it got caught between my vibrator and, <laughs> <laughs> and the dildo and I went, ooh. And I ooh, just, that's kind of kinky. <laughs> I just reached down and pulled it over to the side. So yes, it can get caught. Come on. I want women to kind of love their bodies more, that we have this kind of like sanctity of the body. We'd never have anyone tell us that something's wrong with our sex organ. Like we, I want us to be like men, be like, what? All the other guys I slept with loved my labia. I want us to have those kind of answers. Well, we do every now and then. I mean, um, like, like women, some women are concerned about the size of their clitoris. I remember doing this in the workshop when we were doing the the the, uh, the photographs of women's genitals. I remember this one woman got up and she had really a big clitoris and big labia, and I yeah. went, "Oh my God, that's beautiful!" And she said, "You know, I really prefer the smaller ones; they're more feminine." Who says what's feminine? Well, I guess it's up to each of us to determine that, isn't Ooh, it? I like but that. But if you're a victim of fashion or porn. Love your labia, ladies. Love them. They're part of your sex organ. They're filled with nerve. It's the same thing as men getting their foreskins cut off. Poor babies. Stop mutilating sex organs, America. Stop it. That's a direct order.